Hey guys, this is Dory Rocker. I'm just Kay here back with another video. And this is what I like to call a three in one. I got three of these then, now, and forever packs, which they did just change. Now, the front has Sting on it, Brock Lesnar, and it pretty much is completely different. And I can show you because I did pick it up. This is a new pack. See on the top and then the side. And then we have this, which is the Brock Lesnar. So the one I just picked up. This is the one that I got three copies of. Front, side, tops, a little bit different. And Triple H is the main guy in here. So why they stopped doing Triple H and why they uh, switched him out for Brock, I don't know. But I picked up three of these. There's going to be three relics. But first, I will give you just a little rundown of what these cards look like. Uh, I have about 100 in here, so I'm just going to pull out a couple. Here we go. See, we have them like this. They're all very, very nice cards. These are good quality. And they're very, like, um, glossy, which are awesome to get autographed. And the trick to get them autographed is the spot you think the wrestler is going to autograph on it or just do it to the entire card, take an eraser, erase the whole front of the card, and then have them sign over it. It stops it from smudging when you meet people. I learned that trick from uh, a couple different YouTubers. You get a Rock Tribute card in them as well. You got a couple of these cool Rivalry cards, which is now inside the packs. And otherwise, it's just pretty much your basic cards. But I like them better. They're just cooler to get uh, signed and meet because they're just a little better quality than the old ones. Uh, is what I think anyways. The three relics I got. First one, which I think is the coolest out of all of them, is the Undertaker. Um, I guess this is, I don't know what they want to call it. It says it on the back. This is metal right here. And it's this mask that he used to wear, which is really cool. And this is exactly what the back of it says. So I don't know why it says that instead. And then I got a Abuto de Rio shirt relic. Um... Yeah, really don't care for this one. Hey, I built Rio, and, um, I mean, if I ever meet him, I'll get him to sign it. He might do an indie show by me since he's not in WWE anymore. But he isn't really my favorite guy, never really has been. And this was the first one I actually opened. Really was excited for this one. Big E, Royal Rumble, Authentic Matt Relic, which is awesome. Because he was in the Royal Rumble match. So, um, pretty much this mat was used throughout the entire match, so everyone was on it, which makes, to me, the Royal Rumble mat relics and the WrestleMania ones so much better, because there's so many superstars on there, and so much history was made. So, yeah. Yeah. Royal Rumble Biggie. Undertaker, uh, I guess, metal thing. I don't know, it's just really cool. And a Abotororio shirt relic. Those are the three I got inside my top box, and there will be two more coming up. We have... This one, and the Divas Revolution. So make sure to look forward to that in the upcoming videos. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel, because there's always more to come.